Ladies and gentlemen, our first contestant to the stage in the finals of the Australasian Real Estate Institute Auctioneering Championships. Please welcome, all the way from South Australia, Bronte Manuel. <laughs> The great white shark, the African lion and Ponsonby. Buyers, welcome to the top of the food chain. <laughs> I'm Bronte Manuel. My job's to compliment the work that's been undertaken by Chris Batchelor and his very efficient team at Bailey's Realty over the previous weeks. Now, I've heard they've given you bundles of paperwork and in there would have been this agreement. Now, I am going to read from that in a moment. Then I'm going to give you my very brief thoughts on this rare piece of earth. And then we're going to be into the auction shortly afterwards, as I know you're all very busy people. Now, we do sell on behalf of Scott Campbell and Deborah Madden, offering all of that land in Certificate of Title NA152, Folio 34. Mr Auctioneer. Yes, sir. I see that the ownership of this property is nominated as 63% and 37% respectively to the two owners. Yes. That sounds odd. Does this suggest that one party has more say than the other in today's proceedings? Am I compromised? Look, sir, thank you very, very much for your question. I don't think it's odd for your uh, partner to outdo you in performance of income. It happens in my relationship <laughs> personally. <laughs> <laughs> Secondly, sir, I can tell you it has absolutely no bearing of say. I lost a listing the other day. The lady absolutely loved me. She had 70%, he had 30%, and they went with his agent. So, sir, <laughs> you'll be absolutely fine. All the very best. but we need to know what we're buying. So I'm going to get back to that, sir, because you're buying all of the land in lot 71, block two, however, lot two being better known to you, me, and those very fortunate few that live here as 61 Ardmore Road, Ponsonby. Your inclusions and exclusions, very straightforward. They're just as per your contract. The day you move in, the day you become part of this elite suburb. Well, that's been set down for the 21st day of December, 2019. 18, I should suggest, a very generous 73 days from today's date. We do call for a mere 10% of the purchase price as your deposit. And of course, it's an auction. So calling off rights, well, they just don't apply. Scotty and Deb, of which they agree, have given us a reserve price. And subject to reaching or exceeding that figure, and there is no further bidding, the property that will be announced as sold. And then legally, I just can't accept any further bids. Now, as a successful purchaser, you're then going to step forward. Mr. Bachelor, and substitute for a rose, he's going to give you a pen of which you'll sign the contract, failing of which I'll be doing that on your behalf. At the fall of the hammer, the property will be at the risk of the purchaser. But why we're all here, how do we become that person? Quite simply, you do need to be registered and just display your bidding number when making your bid. Now, I can bid on behalf of Scott and Deb. I can do that on two occasions up to, but not including that reserve price, and any such bid, I'll clearly announce it as a vendor's bid. I can refuse a bid if it is deemed not in the best interest of our vendor, and all those big, bold bidding increments, they'll be at the discretion of myself, the auctioneer. All these terms and conditions have been on display for the prescribed time. They're set out by the Real Estate Institute of New Zealand. Uh, our agent's happy with them, as with myself, the auctioneer, but we need you to be as the prospective purchasers. Do I have any last minute questions or queries? Trying to get your bidding card out, folks. I like it. Well, as you drive down the avenues, you'll notice everything is in sync. There is no mismatch here. You see, like-minded locals live in like-minded properties, all in pursuit of maintaining their position at the top of the tree. If you're away for vocation or living it up with vacation, I suggest you talk to June as she'll prune your hedges with spirit level like precision. And if the little fella bumps the gate with his scooter, then you need to go see Trevor at 71. He has the communal paint in. But don't get me wrong, this villa, it is very far from vanilla. In 2016, she underwent open heart surgery, which has given her a very good new outlook on life. Those trademark Edwardian ceilings, they rival Aaron and Mark's pinstripe suits. 
but it's the lights in the hallway that guide you to the new generation of living. It's here, you'll only need two words. OK, Google. And it's upon that command that the VLUX skylights will open, the gas fire will stay at a consistent temperature while you sit back, relax, and let those Amelie appliances cook your dinner. When it is time to retreat, there's a trifecta of bedrooms which are sure to be a winner. But it is that very unique split of 50-50 in the walk-in robe which had me at hello. Very different split to the ownership, sir. Even though the ownership would be a more typical split of the walk-in robe. With a near impossible two off-street parks and 415 square metres of rare turf, folks, I would not want to be in second place today. On that note, who gets us out the gate Mr. first? Mr Auctioneer. Yes, sir. Look, white is not my thing. And with all due respect, there's not a lot else going on here. So if I buy it, can I paint the thing grey, green or purple for that fact? Well, look, thank you very, very much for your question. Trevor is not going to be happy with that question right now with the communal paint tin. But what I can tell you, sir, is properly, these properties, the reason they are so highly regarded, the reason this is at the top of the food chain is because everything is so consistent and that is what is so attractive to this area. What you'll need to do is make your own inquiries, but sir, I tell you what, you should be locked up if you're thinking the colour purple. I do wish you all the very best in your bit. <laughs> On that note, where do we go calling for an opening bid, opening offer to get us started? I would have thought somewhere around 3.5. Sir, what do we suggest? 2,500,000 New Zealand dollars. 2,500,000 New Zealand dollars. Well, sir, I tell you what, a very conservative start, but I'm going to run with it. At 2.5 is the bid now. At 2.5, at that level, Trevor's going to bid against you on his own just to maintain the colour of the street. But at 2.5 <laughs> is the call now. And, folks, at 2.5, I'm just going to run in a quarter from here to take us to 2,750, if we may. At 2,500,000 now, folks, where do we go from here? 2,750, I would have thought logically at this level. At 2.5, $5 million clean in front now. You laughed at his conservative bid, but he could be laughing for years to come now. At 2.5, once, twice, 2.5, I call it now. Third, final opportunity at 2.5 million. Well, I'm not going to hesitate. I'm just going to nudge it north at 2750 with me now, sir. Can I come back with me I'll for give three, you three million? Two, three million. Good to see you, sir. A quarter bid there at three million the call. At three million dollars the bid now on my high flank now at three million. Can I say three and a <laughs> three quarter? Three million and ten. Three million and ten. Gee, you're very early in the piece. Time to shorten my stride. Can you meet me for three and a quarter, sir? Ten. Three million and ten. Okay, at three million and ten. Three million and ten is the bid now. Where do we say three and a quarter? I would have thought logically 25. the next one. Three million and ten, and you're following suit at three million and thirty-five. At three oh thirty-five. Three million and twenty-five. Three million. Oh, twenty-five. Sorry, sir. I thought you said thirty-five. At three million and twenty-five, the bid. At three million and twenty-five. One hundred and twenty-five thousand. Three million and twenty-five at three one fifty, sir. At three million one hundred and fifty, we're nearing closer to those two fifties I was asking for earlier. At three million one hundred and fifty thousand dollars, the bid from here. Where do we go? Three one fifty. I would have thought another two fifty to go on top would have been wise. At three million one hundred and fifty thousand dollars now. Once, twice. Three million one hundred fifty k. Three million. You're strengthening your bid, sir. A man that knows value. At 3.3, he really wants to put his mark on this street with his colours. At 3.3, it is. And he's showing them right now, folks, so don't be intimidated. <coughs> Get back into the bidding if you can. At 3.3. Quarter million. 3.3, you want to take us to 3.550, sir. At 3.550, and I welcome you right in my lap now. At 3.550, the bid, sir, you just call it out and I'll add it up. At 3.550 is the bid. 3550 and 3850. Good to see you, ma'am. You improved your five thousand dollar bids today. I like it at three million eight hundred and fifty thousand dollars the bid. At three million eight three million eight fifty. Three million eight fifty, three eight seventy five. Oh, one twenty five, sir. Three nine seventy five. Sorry to undersell your bid there at three nine seventy five the call. At three nine seventy five, I would have thought fifty thousand to jump us onto the other side of four. At three nine seventy five. Three nine and seven. 3975, so you want to take us to 4125 with you directly in front. At 41 and a quarter the bid. At $4,125,000 from here. 4125 and another 25, 125, 4250 at four and a quarter the bid. At 4250000 man, can you keep maintaining, keep the kettle boiling at that level? At 4250 down in front now. 4250, strengthening it even better. I like it at 4,400 the bid. At double four double zero triple O the call. At 4,400 is the bid. Where do we go from here? At 44, I would have thought another 100 or 150 to go. At 4.4 million dollars now. I'm chasing down another 100,000. At 44, 
Once at 4,400,000, twice, third, final call, 4.4, we call it, we done. 4.4, 4, 4. you're back to your 44, sir, I like it. At 4.4 is the call, so you want to take us to $444,000. And someone, if only they gave me $44 more, it would have been even funnier. So there we are at 4,444,000 4, the call is. We've got four fours and a few noughts after it. At 4,444,000. What's it going to be? You're going to be consistent with those 250s or just the fives, or where's it going to go, ma'am? Another 88, 44, 4,444,000, 4,488,000 to go now. Double four, double eight, triple O the call at 4,488,000. Where do we go, sir? Another 44, I can only guess. At 4,488,000, 4, at 4,493,000. At 4,493,000, you're going to get to 4.5. 4.5. 4.5 is the call now. At $4.5 million, I call it, through here. At $4.5 million, directly in front now. At $4.5 million, where do we go from here, folks? Another 44 to tempt us. At $4.5 million, I'll take just a mere $10,000 from here. At 4.5 now, once. At 4.5, twice. At 4.5 million, I call it now. Third, final opportunity. Are we... 4.5 million... Okay, 4.545, sir, at 5.45 with you with a four in front at 4,545. At 4.545, the bid now, at 4.545, and where we go, another 45 to go, million? 4.590, it is in directly in front now, at 590,000 on top of the 4.5, at 4.590, sir, maintaining the 45s, can I say? 4.590 directly in front six. now. 4.590, 4.6 with you, sir. No, six. 596. 596, I like it. Change of strategy early in the piece. 4.6. 4, 5, 9, 6, and 4.6. There we go. That was the bit I thought you had, sir. At 4.6, and the keys are in your hands, sir, and I welcome you in. At 4.6. 4. 4. 4.6 on... 4.646, sir. I like it. You know what? I'm not going to be able to guess your next bid, and I like it that way. At 4.646 with you. 4.646 now. Coffee here, folks. It's not a beverage. It's a religion. Where do we go at 4.646 it is? At $4,646,000. Once, twice, 4646, take us straight to 4.7, what do we say? 4646, second, third. 4646, where were you? Bid? 46 again. 4646, we're going to take us to 46 and 92 in front now. 46 and 92, the bid. At 4692, I call it through. 692,000 in front of the four. Who's going to tip us over the five now? 46 and 92. I would have thought Seven. 46 and 92. Seven million a man of your calibre, sir. No, seven. Four, six and ninety-nine, let's call it. Four, six and ninety-nine on top. Four point seven million. Oh, four point seven, sir. At four point seven, I've got it. At four point seven it is now. At four point seven million dollars, folks, we enter the valley of no return. Where do we go from here? At four four point seven and forty-seven. 747 and we ascend on the plane to ownership, folks. At 747 on top of the four now, at 4,747. Sir, do you want to take us straight to it? Where do we go? At 4747 directly in front now. Ma'am, another 47. 4747. You want to take us to 47 and 84 in front now? 4794. 47 and 94 it is. At 47 and 94 the bid now. At 794 is the bid. At 47. 974 with you. 4-7, can we get you to confirm your bid? I want you to spend the right amount of money, that's all. Yeah, 4,794,000 it is. At 4,794,000 the bid. At 4,794,000 folks, who's going to take us to 4.8 or there over? At 4,794,000, once, twice, 4,794,000. 4, you want to take us to 80 grand, sir? 47 and 94, it's going to take us to 4864. Is that correct at 4864 in front now? At 48 and 74. 48 and 74, the bid now. $4,874,000 the bid. Take us straight to 4.9 if we may. At 48 and 74, directly in front now, chasing us down to 4.9, surely. At 48 and 74, once, twice, 48 and 74, I call it. Third, final call, 48 and 74. The one to take us to 49, 48 and 74. Are we done? Finished in silence. 4.9 for it's going to sit with me on behalf of the owner at 4.9. 80 grand. 4.980. 4980 it is. Good to see you back in, sir, at 980 the call. At 4980, I thought my SPF joke yesterday might have scared you off, but it hasn't. At 4980 in front. At 4980,000. It is 4954. 
four million nine hundred and eight, four million nine fifty four. Then, sir, at four nine and fifty four. At four nine and fifty four, the call directly in front now at four million nine hundred and fifty four thousand dollars. Four nine fifty four, ma'am. I can see you tempted there, looking down, looking for some authority. At four nine and fifty four, once, twice. Four nine and fifty four. Forty. Third. Forty. Four nine and ninety four, sir. Four nine and ninety four. The bid now at double nine four. The call at four million nine hundred and ninety four thousand dollars. Five million dollars going to be a psychological strategy. Four nine and ninety four. You want to take us to five oh four, sir? Directly in front now at five million and four thousand dollars. He's over that psychological number, folks. Sir, you've been coughing all the time. When you move here, you will not cough anymore. I promise you that. It's time to get registered. At five million and four, it is now. At five million and four, can we take it north another twenty thousand dollars? Take us to five and a quarter. At five million and four dollars, at four thousand, I call it once, twice. Five million and four. Third, final call. Five million and four thousand. We done. Finished. Silence. Sir, I'd hate to make a Northern Territory and a mistake. So what I'm going to do at $504,000, purely $5,004,000, the property is on the market and the property will be sold. So in the absence of any further bidding, folks, I am not talking to my vendor. We are for genuine sale and this is where it lies at present. At $5,004,000 now, I call it through once at $1,500. $5,004,000, $5,500,000 we do now, sir. At five thousand and five hundred bid the bid at five double oh five double oh the call now at five million and five thousand five hundred once twice I'll chip away in thousands if it helps at five and a half five million and five and a half five million and eleven in front now and five and legs eleven comes out to play I like it at five oh double one triple oh the bid now at five million and eleven another five and a half sir five million and sixteen and a half directly in front now at five oh one six five hundred the bid. At 5016500, another five and a half, sir. 5016500, 521.00 it is. At 5,021,000 with you now, sir. At 5,021,000 it is. 5,22,000, 5,22 it is. I keep just shaving it off easier for you. I don't know why I'm doing that, but at 5,22 is the call. At 5,022,000, keep it going, sir. At 5,000, 5,022,000. Is that a five and a half? 5,027,000 and a half in front now. At 27,500 on top of the five. At 5,027,500. Five million and twenty-seven and a half. We're going to take us to thirty-three. At five million and thirty-three, the bid now. At five million and thirty-three, I keep getting tempted to smile for the camera, but I've got to keep my eyes on the prize. At five million and thirty-three, it is five million and thirty-eight and a half down in front now. At thirty-eight and a half on top of the five now. Five million and thirty-eight five hundred. What's twice? Five million and thirty-eight five hundred. Five million and forty-four. At five million and forty-four, it is now, sir. Forty-four for Chinese is not a fa very favourable number, folks. We don't want to stay on there. At five million and forty-four, the bid. Can we say five to go, sir? At five million and forty-four, sir. You gave me an ownership question, and you're yet to bloody bid. Where do we go from here? At five million and forty-four thousand dollars now. Five million and forty-four. Can I tempt you in with another five to go? Five million and forty-four. Once, twice. Up there, sir. You're in front, but you're not in front with the bidding. At five million and forty-four, the checkered flag is up, and we sell. Third, final call. Five million and. Forty-four thousand dollars. Go five and a half thousand. How many? Five and a half thousand. Five million and forty-nine and a half with you, sir. Five million and forty-nine, five hundred, and over the page we go. At five million and forty-nine and a half. Where do we go from here, folks? Another five and a half could be good. At five million and forty-nine thousand five hundred dollars. I'll take a thousand if it helps. Five million and forty-nine five hundred. Once, twice. Five forty-nine five hundred. Third, final call. Done. Finished. Silent. We're on the market. We sell to the man in the pinstripe suit. He matches the ceilings. At five forty-nine and a half. Going. Going. Hey. Another five and a half, sir. Five forty-nine and a half. You want to take me to five fifty? Five. Five million and fifty-five. Debbie. At five million and fifty-five now. At five o double five. A few nods of the head there. At five o double five. Triple o here. At five million and fifty-five, sir. Why are you laughing up there? You are not in front. What do we say? Come back with me. At five million and fifty-five, the bid in front. The same applies for you, sir. At five million and fifty-five, what happened with our starter over here? I would have thought you'd come back in with me, sir. At five million and fifty-five thousand dollars, once, twice. You're getting in on the bottom of the escalator. It's only going to go up from here. Could have, should have, would have. It's all up to you. At five million and fifty-five thousand dollars now. Third, final call done. Man, even if it was a shambles, it's an absolute delight to have you here. I like it. At five million and fifty-five is the call. At five two oh five with you. At five two oh five. I do not know who coached you on your bidding overnight, but I like that person, and I'm going to send all my buyers there in future. At five two oh five. At five million two hundred and five thousand dollars. Five and a half. 
5205, 5210 and a half. Five and a half. $5.5 million with you, sir. At 5.5. And me in shambles or not, I need you to front up and take him on. What do you say? At 5.5. Five and a half. 5.5. Another 50 on top at 5.550. Five, five and a half. 5505 and a half then, sir. At 5505 and a half, I call it through now. 505,500. Once, twice. 505,500. 50 grand. 505. Okay, sir. 505. 505, 500, thanks to 555. 500, $5,555,000. Well, folks, I tell you what, I'm not much into tongue twisters, but you're delighting me in that space today. At $5,555,000, I call it here now. Is $5,555,500. Oh, yes, sir. Oh, you added the extra bit on the end. I like it, yes, like the slithering snakes. At $5,555,500 now. Once, twice, 5,555,500. Third, final call. Here we are, directly in front. $5,555,500. We sell. Are we done? Do I formally have your best? You've got the paddle waiting, sir. I do not think I do. Do I formally have your best? Three and a half. Five million five hundred and fifty-nine. Five million five hundred and fifty-nine thousand dollars. I call it through now. At five million five hundred and fifty-nine thousand dollars is the bid with three and a half on top. At five million five hundred and fifty-nine thousand dollars now. Once, twice. I'll take a thousand if it helps. At five million five hundred and fifty-nine thousand. Bid another twenty-two. Third, final call. Are we done? Finished? Silence, sir. This is not the time to leave. Sorry, I thought you were getting up. At five million five hundred and fifty-nine thousand, I sell. Go in. Go in. Do I formally have your best up here? 5,559,000 over here. Do I have your best, sir? Do I have your best? 5,559,000. Sir, do I have your best? Do I have your best? 5,559,000. Third final, I sell. Going, going. Stop! <laughs> You look like a very, very good looking rooster and I doubt I need to say it, but regardless of your current social status, you've gone up a couple pegs today. Very, very well done. To the underbidders, all the very, very best in your next sort of acquisition. I challenge you to find better, dare I rub the salt into the wounds. But on behalf of our very good team at Bailey's, have a great afternoon. Thank you. Thank you.